Hey, brother. Shalom. <laughs> Shalom, really? Yeah. Root, uh, yeah, we're, we're gonna go plant the bomb right now in the water. <laughs> Jesus, don't say that. <laughs> Do not say that. Um, we're on our way to a, a bass spot way up here. Look at that. Looks That's like there should be bass right in there. I know. Doesn't it? Swamp. We should try the swamp. The maybe swamp. The, sw maybe the swamp monsters. Gator. Gators, yeah. No, no the, mm -hmm. the, the elusive Nova Scotia alligator. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. It's beautiful though. Yeah. That's the lake we're going to, but we got to walk all the way up here to get us quite a walk, isn't it, Mike? Oh yeah, good walk. Yeah, so a lot of good, good scenery around here. A lot of nature. Except for you, you're ugly. I know, right? Well, it's been about three hours of walking, eh? <laughs> <laughs> the, 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 the fun of planted. The, the, the fun, <laughs> the fun of uh, being able to edit. <laughs> Three hours later. The bombs are planted. Yeah. All the occupied. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> no, Mike, bad. <laughs> Hit you with the ugly stick like your mom did. There you go, look, there's a fork for you. I don't think that would be suitable, but good eye. So yeah, um, of course I got my slingshot and we're being so loud, we're gonna scare anything that's uh, in the woods here. There's lots of grouse here, or some people around here like to call them partridge. Um, and uh, we're probably scaring them, aren't we, Mike? <laughs> I'm gonna have to edit out your voice in this. Get us arrested. Okay, anyway. wait, ready, ready to edit? Ready to edit? Ready? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> so it's been what? Three or four hours of us walking, trying to get to this spot. Six. <laughs> six hours. Yeah, you look like you're holding up we're, pretty we're, good. Right now, six in the morning. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> we, left <at> <laughs> we left at midnight. Of course we did. <laughs> yeah, because we're, we're dedicated, <laughs> right? And here's the spot. <laughs> so, I got my slingshot with me. We're probably scaring away all the grouse and the what people like to call partridge here. Uh, it's beautiful, eh? The sun's starting to come out. So I think I'll put this thing on, turn this off, and then uh, get my slingshot out, I think, for the walk. See if we can't get something. And then, fishing time. Right? Right on. Don't trip. On guard! <laughs> Three days later, we're almost at our destination. Okay. See how sunny it is today compared to what it was 10 minutes ago? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everything you see is not exactly what it appears to be. Walk into the twilight zone. <laughs> do, 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 do. So instead of cutting through the wood, you cut through the way. Yeah, we're down the lower end. So we took a right. Well, I was actually right then because I said if we're there already, then we're. Yeah. It took really, uh, didn't take very long. So it should have taken us about another 10 or 15 minutes to get there. Oh well. Oh yeah, we're, we're gonna fish this area anyway, so there's the dam. Yeah, out here in the open, it's gonna be windy. Make casting fun, won't it? Oh yeah. The water's choppy. Oh, it's nice. it's yeah. We got a high water level. Been getting a lot of rain lately. It's yeah, because normally the water doesn't go over that. That's right. It's beautiful though. Happy to be here. Oh yeah. This is where you get your mind, right? That's right. Let's catch some fish. Or this campground. Well, Boy Scout uh, camp site. It's been abandoned for some time now. Oh yeah. It's a good place to uh, pop a tent. Yeah. I'll be putting up a lean-to there. I think so we can come down and do some weekend fishing. Oh yeah. And some hunting. It's the best time to have a kayak too. Or... Yeah. Hey brother. Nice and calm on the side, isn't it? Yeah. 
video recording actually. Yeah. Yeah. I hope they're having better luck than we are. Yeah. Did you? Oh, you stopped fishing. I was going to pan over and get you at the, that cut. <laughs> Retake. I'll just get you. Nice cast. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. The water's still quite cold here in Nova Scotia, and we're, we're fishing bass, and uh, unfortunately, chain pickerel, because the chain pickerel are taking over our waterways, so we're trying to eradicate them, but I, I don't think it's gonna happen. Once they're in the water, um, they're there for good, and they kill everything else off. So, uh, Right now, the temperature is only about, probably, what, eight degrees Celsius, 10 degrees Celsius? Air temperature, yeah. Air temperature, so the water temperature is quite a bit cooler than that, so we're not expecting to get any any smallmouth today, but hopefully we'll land a couple monster chain pickerel and get a few of the breeders out of the water. Anyway, it's, uh, if he hooks into one, which he probably won't because he's not a very good fisherman. How are you, bud? Anyway, if he, ca <laughs> if, he, if he catches one right now, it'd be awesome. But I doubt it. Just joking. <laughs> yeah. It's quite windy today, too. So uh, we're, we're down this little cove where we started was right up there at the screens but the wind was blowing this way, like from crosswind, like that. Um, and it was so windy over there, you could hardly cast. So we walked down through the woods here, um, down through the woods along this edge, down behind this, and then came back over here. You, pro you know what, Mike? You'll probably have better luck there than you normally do. <laughs> Sun's coming out. Yeah. Got a fork for you. I got my. I even got my friends looking for slingshot forks. What do you mean? Well, there's a fork. Holy fork. And what's your idea of carving that beast? Yeah, it's a little smaller. Of course, like you have your thumb in here, but that's too much of a gap. If you have something there to keep your thumb in for that stability. Mm -hmm. That's what I was thinking, like something just different. Like, What if it was turned the other, the other way? way? Well, we're not going to use this fork. No, no, no. But if you could find a fork like that, yeah. that could be where your thumb goes here. Yeah, like something a little different. Yeah. Something unique. Only true friends are looking for slingshot forks for somebody when they don't use slingshots themselves. Why don't you use a slingshot? Mike, you're my best friend. Because I never get into it. Yeah. I suck. Yeah, everybody sucks until they get good. You know that, right? Practice, practice, practice. You should be ashamed of yourself. Your best friend has such a passion for slingshots and you don't, you're not into it. Wait, here's quotations. You're not into it. I'm going home! <laughs> cool. No, but seriously, that means... Go 10, I do believe. Left. Yeah. 
はいねえ Roger, that time, didn't I? Good shot. Yeah. Well, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Nice. My alien. Next is the anal probe. This was called the probe originally. <laughs> it was, <laughs> honestly, but someone else said it looked more like an alien. Uh, so no anal probes today. Yeah, it's kind of ripped too. Yeah, for anybody's pleasure. Yeah. Looks like he's probably uh, Let's 13. Let's find out. No, bud, you're off. 17. 17, wow. Huh. I'm sorry, bud. It's not your fault that you're invasive, but. It's a little bit bigger than 17. 17 and, seven, oh look, 17 and a half. Let's see what this chamber hole's been eating. Yeah. Bugs. Oh, yeah. No, no. That's a female. Look at the light. Good thing we got her. Rose, yeah. Good thing we got her. She's ready to spawn. I don't like killing the animals. I'm going to eat this one, but. Um, I don't get any joy in it, but I don't want our waters to be overtaken by these and they already are really let's see what we got here uh, i need a place to what was it little nets or nets whatever you call them bug larvae i think yeah grubs yeah. larvae yeah that's all it's been eating yeah, just bugs. Wow. So yeah, um, in Nova Scotia we have a a call on these, and uh, the uh, they're doing a, a, they want the the heads and the stomach contents. I shouldn't have done this. I can still give the the stomach contents to them, but I think they want to remove them themselves. It's part of the um, MCG Mi'kmaq Conservation Group, um, based in Truro or Millbrook, and so they would really appreciate it if whoever catches these let them know at least where they're where they've been caught and the size of the of the uh, pickerel and uh, the head and the stomach. Would be appreciated if you could donate it to them or give it to them some person in some way. Um, it'll help try to eradicate these things. Uh, again, it's not the fish's fault. I feel bad, you know, in some ways. But if you can see the teeth in the mouth of this, it's probably hard to see them. He doesn't have very big teeth. The bigger ones. Bigger ones have really big teeth, and they'll eat anything. It doesn't matter if they're hungry, hungry or not. You see up there on the roof of its mouth, the rows of teeth. Ouch! I just got some in my fingers. See that? Those are all teeth right there. Rows and rows of them, like a shark almost. See that, Mike? Mm-hmm. And they're like flexible. So when they grab on, when they grab onto a fish, the fish has not like no chance at all of getting away. Grabs on and these teeth fold around it. And they gulp them right down. Those ones are big, look. Look at that. Oh, yeah. For a small fish. I don't think I can get it. There 
You see that? Yeah. Pretty crazy, eh? Now, bass were uh, introduced, and everybody's complaining about these being introduced and killing off the bass, but what's happening to our trout population? That's the thing that everybody should be really worried about. And the salmon. We already have, yeah, we already have a problem with, with the trout population and salmon now. This place used to be full of trout at one time. But anyway, the catch is a catch. <laughs> If you enjoyed this video and want to see more like it, please subscribe. Thanks. Mi'kmaq Warrior Slingshots.